I started when I was three years old. And I think the, the earliest memory I got is uh, just kind of in kindergarten or wherever in that kind of region of how old I was. My dad kind of would take me out of lunch a little bit. And he'd take me to skate on a little three-on-three -three rink at Velocity in Minnesota there. And I think that's just where I fully started. Those skating sessions would lead Sam Renzel to a successful start early on, especially this season, as he went down to Waterloo in the USHL to play a before and after season, was named a captain for Chaska High School, and is a top prospect in this year's NHL draft, a season that helped him evolve his game. In the USHL, you're, you're playing against bigger, stronger guys, and the pace is just a little bit faster, but... You know, I think it's 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 a little easier in a sense. Uh, I think everyone knows the game a little bit more. And, you know, it's older guys. They, they've been around it longer and they have that experience that you're able to kind of play alongside them with. And, and then going back to Chaska, I think, you know, it was pretty fortunate. I was being able to be named captain and I was able to go there and and grow as a leader and and grow as a as a man. And as myself, being able to grow into that, it's, it was pretty special. There are a couple parts to Rinzel's game he finds key. You know, size is a big one for me, and I think I'm a, uh, I'm a really good skater. And kind of my puck handling and my hockey IQ is a big one that I like to stick to my strengths for. And just things that I like to get better at is just my defensive game a little bit and kind of refining my game for sure. The same names many watch on game nights are also ones with a skill set Rinzel is influenced by. You see guys like Kale McCarr and how they're able to contribute offense and, you know, bigger guys like Headman and John Klingberg and Mira Heiskinen and all those kind of deep puck moving defensemen that, you know, they're pretty fun to watch. This homegrown Minnesotan won't be going away anytime soon as one of the next stops on his hockey journey will be the University of Minnesota. It's, you know, it was a dream ever since I was a little kid. And, you know, when I was fortunate enough to get a call and, and check out a visit there, it's I loved every part of it, and it was it was pretty hard to say no. So it's going to be great being able to have all my my grandpa coming up and all my family members, my cousins. It's it's going to be pretty fun. As far as where he hopes the game will take him, whatever my dreams kind of live up to. It's you know I want to be able to play in the NHL. I want to be able to win a Stanley Cup, and you know it's just you know I'm not worried that far down the road. But those are my dreams, and you know I'm worried about the present right now. So.